The point of this video is I'm going to ask my gorgeous girlfriend Monica to marry me. I'm going to ask her to be my wife. I'm going to break it down for you very, very quickly how I'm going to do this. Monica and I started dating on the 16th of October 2015 and I asked her to be my girlfriend while walking along a beach in Nice in the south of France. For our fourth anniversary, I'm going to surprise her with a trip back to Nice and on the 16th of October, which is our four year anniversary, I'm going to rent a yacht for the day play her a video highlighting everything we've done over the past four years together and showing her how much I love her and then when the video ends I'm gonna be on one knee and I'm going to ask her to be my wife. I'm super nervous just thinking about doing this, oh my gosh. Obviously before that I'm gonna ask Monica's father for his blessing. I'm gonna give him a call and uh, ask for his blessing and right now, the reason I'm nervous right now because it's currently the 13th of August right now um, I am just about to head to a jeweler's where I'm going to go pick out an engagement ring for Monica. Okay, let's do this. Let's go to the jeweler's, pick out an engagement ring for my future wife. <sighs> okay, two hours later, I've ordered Monica's ring. It's been custom made and I'm picking it up on October the 7th. Oh my gosh, it's all done. I paid for the ring. I'm very, very excited. Let's look forward to October the 7th. I'm going to ask for Monica's father's blessing. Surprise her by taking her to the south of France and, uh, <laughs> ask her to be my wife. Slight change of plans. So I was planning originally on telling Monica that I'm surprising her by bringing her to the south of France about a couple of days or so before we leave on the 15th of October. It's currently the 2nd of September right now and Monica's been hinting that she wants to book something for our anniversary. Plus her mum is flying over on the 23rd of September and she wants to take her somewhere in Europe. So, I feel like I need to tell her now what the anniversary present's gonna be. What she doesn't know is on the 16th of October, which is our anniversary, I'm gonna ask her to marry me. Obviously, I'm not gonna tell her that now, but yeah, she doesn't know that she's gonna come back from this trip as my fiance, if she says yes. <laughs> Fingers crossed she does. Anyway, let's go tell her. Darling, please can you come down here, baby? So, I <laughs> What are you doing? So, you were telling me before, well, you weren't telling me, you were trying to guess what our anniversary present was before. Um, <laughs> and you were saying that you kind of wanted to book something for us. Um, so I thought, just to kind of make sure we don't kind of cross paths, I'll just tell you what it is now. Instead of telling you, I'm going to just ask you a question. Where did I ask you to be my girlfriend? In Nice. Yeah. I booked an apartment there and booked our flights for a week from the 15th to the 22nd of October. <laughs> You're kidding! You're kidding! Oh my gosh, thank God I tell you so early! Honey! I was literally about to book that for you! You're kidding! That's why I said it earlier. I said it in a way where I was like, I would need to oh. book it. Guys, thank gosh I beat her to it. You Indeed. are so cheeky, naughty! Mm. And we got a lovely little apartment. Um, just next to the port, which is, I know you love staying there. You are so naughty. <laughs> Thank you, sweet man. That's too much. No, it's not. That's way too You're much. You're going to do that for me. So, I like treating you. No, I like treating no, you. No, honey. I'm so excited, crazy. That went well, didn't it? Little does she know that that's only a tiny portion of her present. I'll see you guys when I pick up the ring ask for a dad's blessing, and then the big day will arrive. Today is the 25th of September, and Monica's mum is actually visiting from New York, so I've got the house to myself right now because they've gone off shopping, which leaves me with about an hour to two hours window for me to basically undertake the most nerve-wracking part of this, which is asking for her father's blessing. Thankfully, I'm very, very close with both her parents. I'm very close with her dad and very close with her mum. So I'm pretty confident he's going to say yes, but just out of respect for him, I want to ask him anyway for his blessing before I ask Monica to marry me. So Monica is very close with her dad, so I want to do this, even though it's terrifying. <laughs> I'm going to FaceTime him, because obviously I'm three and a half thousand miles away from him right now. He lives in New York. I'm not joking, guys. This is the most nervous I've ever been in my life. By the way, if I go, hey, yo, Sean, when I call him, it's because I don't know how it started, but I call him Sean and he calls me Mr. Kingston. I've got no idea, so together we're Sean Kingston. I don't know how it started. Hey, yo! Hey, yo! What up? 
So I was actually calling you for something specific. I didn't really want to do this over the phone because I kind of really wanted to do it in person. But I mean, living three and a half thousand miles away from each other is, is not really the easiest thing. <laughs> I'm so in love with Monica, it's insane. I was going to come up with a whole speech, but the fact of the matter is I want to spend the rest of my life with her. And I want to ask her to marry me. So before I do that, I'd, I'd love to get your blessing. Oh no, you cut out! I'd honestly rehearsed that so much. I heard I heard the last though, and of course. Yeah? No, she feels the same way, so there's no doubt in her mind. Well, you don't know how happy that makes me. I was kind of worried you thought it'd be kind of too early, but I mean, we've been together four years, so... Uh, yeah, yeah. I know a lot of people have been saying it for a while for us to kind of get married because it'd be easier with visas and stuff like that, but... I wanted to kind of really wait until she knew that I was asking her to marry me because I want to spend the rest of my life with her rather than because it's convenient for our relationship. And oh, yeah. I kind of feel like we're at that point now, which is... That, that's the only way. Yes. Do you remember the other day when we were on FaceTime and I said I'd rented a yacht for the day that, that got cancelled? Yeah. I was planning on doing it then, on our anniversary, and it got cancelled. <laughs> so instead, I found a really cool viewpoint um, that looks over Monaco and it's like the nicest view ever. I I'm gonna ask her on, on our anniversary on the 16th of October. Oh yeah? It's the 16th? Yeah. Um, ah, beautiful. Can you just do me one thing? Yes. Bring, bring like, uh, I don't know, maybe a 300 roll of uh, Kleenex. <laughs> <laughs> I just texted her about it. Oh yeah? She said cool. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, and like I said, you're the only person in the entire world that knows it, obviously apart from me, that knows about this. <laughs> so. <sighs> okay, that's done with. He's given me his blessing. He started tearing out, which is the most amazing thing. I showed him a video that I made for Monica to show her when I'm going to propose to her. You guys will see that very soon. So yeah, next stop is picking up the ring, and then it's time to propose. No, you don't need to take sunglasses off, you look lovely. It's been a couple of weeks or so since I last talked to you. And uh, I'm here with a special guest today, Monica's mum. She's got hey. no idea what's going on. Um, okay, this is kind of crazy. What? The place we're going is called Diamond Heaven. Yes. Can you kind of guess what it is? No, you're not. <laughs> Are you? Are you? Oh my god! <laughs> No. Oh, oh my god, I'm so happy! I'm gonna cry! Oh my god! I love you, Mama. Sam! The only other person I'm in the entire The only other person in the entire world that knows is Rob when I ask for his blessing. Look, I'm shaking! <laughs> oh my god! I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry. Cut. Sam, let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Did you expect that? No! <laughs> oh my god, I'm like shaking. <laughs> Do it. I found a viewpoint over Monica and I'm gonna ask on our anniversary. Oh, I can't. I'm gonna cry. Am I crying? <laughs> oh my god. I love you, Mama. I'm so glad you told me. Yeah. You're the best! So, right now, we are in a hotel in Manchester and uh, we're going to pick up the ring. I, I custom made a I ring for her. I teach your mum in. I already call her mum in law. Like, we're so close, I mean. Oh, I'm so excited. Look, I'm shaking. Yeah? Look. Yeah, I love you. <laughs> I custom ordered a ring in August and uh, it's ready today, so we're gonna oh, it today. I'm so glad you're sharing this with me. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm so ready for this. <laughs> it's this one. I sat right here and I picked out everything. So I picked out one of these ones first. And I picked one of these owners. That's what she wanted. It's gonna be amazing. I'm so, telling right now. Okay, are you excited? I'm the one getting engaged. Okay, are you ready? Yes. One, two, three. Oh my god. <laughs> what do you think? This is like a dream come up. What do you think? I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> Don't cry! Oh, yeah. Please have a look. Aww, it's so sweet! Aww! Is that the one she likes? Yeah, that's the exact one she wants. Done it! it is you like it? Beautiful. I like it. Thank you. If you want to, please. Oh my god. 
god. What do you think? This is like perfect. Like I couldn't pick, you couldn't pick a more perfect one. <laughs> and that's this it guys. Like dream ring. Oh, I can't see the sparkle on the camera, but it's fine. I've got to be really quiet as Mark is upstairs packing. So we are traveling to France today and tomorrow is the big day. I'm starting to get really nervous now. I didn't get much sleep last night. I feel like tonight's our first night in France, so I'm gonna get no sleep whatsoever. But it's okay, because at the end of the day, I'll have a fiance, <laughs> which would be crazy. Anyway, I think Marcus' mum took it really well. I was actually, I was really happy with her reaction actually, and how much she was kind of accepting me straight away into her family. It was, it was really reassuring and really nice. Um, I'm glad both her parents are on board, and they're the only two people in the entire world I know. My parents don't know, none of my friends, nobody in the world knows apart from her parents. So let's see how it goes tomorrow. In about 24 hours time, I'm gonna be proposing. Today's the day. This is my view right now. As you can tell by the sunrise, it's pretty early. I've gone on a two mile walk to go and collect a car that I've rented for the day. And then basically, we're gonna head up to a spot near Monaco, while well, just overlooking Monaco, called La Tête de Chien, which, if you speak French, it means the head of dog, which is weird. But uh, we're gonna go there, and uh, I'm gonna pop the question there. Welcome back to our channel. Um, as you can tell, I'm by myself right now. That is because Sam is going to pick up our rental car because we are back in Nice, France, where Sam and I first started dating four years ago today. Yes, today is our four year anniversary, so it's a really special day, but as you could probably tell from my appearance and my voice, um, I'm very ill. I've never gotten this bad from a cold. I'm assuming it's a cold. It's not a good day for me. However, it is because it's our four year anniversary, so I can't help but to feel happy and energetic. So as I said, Sam is going to pick up the rental car, so before he gets back, I got some balloons I'm gonna set up. I wanna just do it before he gets back because obviously he's coming back and I want it to be ready. <laughs> it's 10.21 in the morning right now. I rented a little mini for the day. I actually love it to be honest. It's a lovely little car. So as I was renting this, Monica's getting ready for the day and basically what she thinks is she thinks we're just going to Monaco for our anniversary. So hopefully it's all gonna go well. By the way guys, next time I talk to you, I'm gonna be with Monica. Obviously you guys know that I'm proposing today, but Monica has no idea, obviously. I'm gonna be talking about our anniversary and going to Monaco for, for our anniversary, but obviously we both know it's something slightly different. The balloons are supposed to look like that, right? Like hearts? What is this? <laughs> are you kidding? <laughs> Hold up, I think it was just a bad balloon. Yay! Now I'm happy. A few of them popped, and then obviously we have that. But I think they came out like cute. I also got this four balloon, so I'm gonna put this. Let's see, if he walks in there. Oh my gosh, where do I put this? This is a disaster. It's about Julio Ricardo Let's wait for him to come back. Oh, I'm excited. She is. Look how gorgeous she is. Oh, oh honey. Darling girl. Look at this. Happy four years. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, no, that was my favorite. Oh, What's up, guys? <laughs> anyway, um, I picked up a car. So, uh, let's get going. Let's get going. Sam just stepped in poop. Great start to the day. I literally <laughs> slid in it. It was so big, I went. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello. It's a cute little car, right? I'm so excited. Let's go. <laughs> Hi, so Hello. we are here at the spot called La Tête de Chien. Unfortunately, there's no dogs here, honey, but what there <laughs> is, is an incredible view. I already see it. <laughs> I so already smooth. see it. Are you are so smooth. Baby, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Look at 
that for a view for our anniversary. Insane. There we go. Recording. What are you doing? Right, I want you to hold that, face away, press play. Wait, what's going on? Monica, what can I say? Ever since I first laid eyes on you four years ago, my life has changed so dramatically, and it's all thanks to you. Together, we've explored countless countries, bought a house, started a multi-award winning company, starred in our own MTV show, and so much more. You've taught me not just what it feels like to be loved, but also how to love unconditionally. So this is for you. You look gorgeous. You always look gorgeous. No way! Does it fit no well? No way! I just feel like this isn't happening. It's not. So a few years ago, I jokingly asked if you'd marry me, to which you replied yes. Would your answer still be the same after all of our years of experiences together? Monica, I've got a question to ask you. Can you put the laptop down, please? This is a prank. <laughs> Just close it and put it down. <sighs> yeah, maybe don't let it slip off. <laughs> this is a prank. If this is a prank, this isn't what you're doing. Monica, four years ago today, I asked you to be my girlfriend, right here in the south of France. Uh, actually, well, I was about 10 miles away. <laughs> but um, during those four years, I've realized you are 100% my soulmate. <laughs> and, uh, no, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. <laughs> Will you marry me? <laughs> you're joking. This is a prank. No. This is a prank. No. It's not a prank. You swear? I swear on my life. No way! Is it a yes? No, of course it's a yes! No! This isn't real! This isn't real! No, it's not! This is a prank! This is a prank! This is a prank! It's not a prank! Stop saying it's a prank! It's not a prank! Does it fit? What do you think? It's real. This is not real. It's real. This is not real. It's real. Are it's you? real. No, this is not real. No, this is not real. This isn't real. This is real. This isn't real. Daddy. Daddy, no, it's not. It's real. It's real. I love you so much. Daddy, no way. This is real. This is real. Are you pranking me? I need to know if this is a prank. I'm not pranking you, I swear. What the heck? Are you crazy? <laughs> yeah. What? Not as crazy heck? as you, though. <laughs> now, let's get off this rock before you uh, accidentally fall off it because that's a 550 meter drop. That's a 1500 foot drop down there, so. Sorry, oh, honey. <laughs> She won't stop saying this is a prank. This is not a prank. I swear on my life, this is real. I want to marry you, baby. Well, this is not what I was expecting at all. <laughs> Honey, I thought this would be going to be in like five years. <laughs> Do you remember that one day when your mum was here and you guys went shopping and went to the cinema? Yes. I called your dad and asked for his blessing. No. And we both cried together on FaceTime. He cried? He cried. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, you'll never marry my daughter. No, I'm joking. <laughs> This <laughs> <laughs> just is not happening. Like this is gonna happen. I'm sleeping. Oh, it's because happened. I'm ill that I think I, I like am hallucinating. <laughs> like you're probably yelling at me right now, telling me to stop saying we're engaged, but like, I feel like I'm just hallucinating. Imagine you wake up now. Oh, would you look at this plant? <laughs> look at this plant, how nice. Or if you wanted to see my phone. Oh by the way guys, let's show you the ring. <laughs> there is the ring. Oh, it looks so perfect on your gorgeous hand. <laughs> Look at the sparkle. Ooh. 
Ooh. Oh yeah. Uh, is there something <laughs> on my face? Is there something <laughs> on my face? Oh, you look so gorgeous. So baby, you've got a wedding to plan. Fiance, I understand. Like, what do we do now? <laughs> well, what we do right now is we're going to go into Monaco. We're going to get some lunch. And then we're going to head back to the apartment and tell everyone. Oh my we god. We want to tell our friend, friends and family, don't we? Yes. Should we record it? Yeah. I love you so much. I love you so much, my fiance. <laughs>